Oh my god. Fought a big snake. Made a rocket fall from the sky. Pretty good day. Wow, those things look like Velociraptors, but even more like Velociraptors than the Velociraptors in the last game. Crazy. Whoa. For a lifetime spent in the pursuit of knowledge, one question consumed me. How did our world come to be? The old ones perished a thousand years ago triggering the extinction of all life. She showed me how it was reborn. A little outcast girl, ignorant of her own importance. Through her, I learned that life was only saved through a technological miracle. Zero Dawn. A terraforming system composed of nine subordinate functions. Each playing its part to reshape Earth from a barren rock to a lush landscape. Tended and protected by the machines. And with her, I learned the deepest secret of them all. The secret of her birth that she is a clone of Elizabeth Subek, Zero Dawn's creator, born to prevent a new extinction. Driven by Hades, a malevolent AI, given sentience by a mysterious signal of unknown origin, and with a little help from me, prevailed in a great battle at the city of Meridian. Becoming a champion for all humankind. But as useful as she has been, now I must leave her behind. For as she strives to put right what Hindi sundered, I have made a new discovery. One that heralds both destruction and opportunity. Ooh, pretty sick. Oh my God, it's gorgeous. That's a big dinosaur. That's an even bigger dinosaur, holy shit. Yeah, but it's so beautiful. People are suffering. Soon, I'll starve. All because of a terraforming system that's spiraling out of control. And only I can fix it. Only I have your genetic code. It won't be long before we hit the point of no return. Oh no, the fox! And then... I've been searching for months for what I need. A backup of Gaia, the AIU designed to control the system. But every time I think I have a lead, did I take her armor? It comes to nothing. Well, like pieces of it. That kind of looks like the armor that Elizabeth was wearing at the end of the game. End of the first game. Every night, I have the same dream. I'm walking under a brilliant night sky, through a field of flowers. And when I arrive at the center, I see you, Elizabeth. Waiting for me, even though you've been 
dead for a thousand years. You're the closest person I've ever had to a mother. And for a moment, I feel whole. But it never lasts. Fun. <laughs> At least it's not like that scene from the first Evil Dead movie. I'm always left alone. This world is your legacy, Elizabeth. I won't let it slip away. The valley below is my only remaining lead. My last hope to find the backup. I'll do whatever it takes to get it. I promise. Oh. Oh. Oh, it's that guy. Oh, what's up, oh. dude? <laughs> if it isn't Aloy, the savior of Meridian, anointed of the Nora. You know I hate being called that stuff. Well, consider it a punishment for running out on us the very same night we beat Hades. I grew up an outcast. Remember, I'm not much for parties. Yeah. But that one was in your honor. Just saying. So, what are we doing? Must be urgent since you left so fast. Delving into ancient ruins? Or maybe it has something to do with the Blight? Both, actually, but, um... I should... Oh, no. I've been dragging you a long way. It's okay. After everything you've done to help the Nora and my family, I swore an oath to help you, no matter what. You're stuck with me now. Oh, great. Like bark on wood. Okay, but if you're going to come with me, you'll need to be able to see what I see. <sighs> what the fuck? She just has a spare focus. A focus? Never thought I'd get your second sight. I'll give you another one later and show you how to back up your data. Data? Information on the device. We've got a lot to cover. Um, I'll have to explain everything as we go. All right, sick. How trippy like would that be? All the time? Since I was a little girl. Come on. Imagine going like 20 years of your life and then you suddenly put this thing on the side of your head and out of nowhere you get like waypoints and markers to places that you're trying to go. Shall we? All right, I got a couple of scrapes on the way here. We should find some medicinal plants, stock up. So it's time for your first lesson with the focus. Sounds good. Let's get started. Oh yeah, I know I've already said it once, but god damn this is beautiful. Okay, so now this is like the new corruption, pretty much. Those ruins, that's where we need to go. Oh, I see, okay. Cool beans. Do I want to jump into the water, or do I want to zip line? I think I'm going to jump. Seems more fun. 
Hell yeah. Fastest way down. Let's go. I didn't. That's not what I meant to do. I didn't mean to just dodge roll off the edge. I meant to do. Oh, wait. Okay, wait. I think I know what it means. So, like. Okay, no, I think I get it. I think I'm not high enough, though. Yeah, there we go. Okay, that's sick. I like that. Oh, the scan works differently now, too. Think of it cool. Like a set of instructions that can fix the world. Oh, hello. It's pretty cool that I have a companion this time. Swipe up on the touchpad. Whoa, that's cool. Can I craft? Yeah, finally. Now I have arrows. Let me examine, bitch. Thank you. Someone took down this machine recently. Who else would come here? I don't know. But good thing we have some arrows of our own. Might be trouble up ahead. Damn straight. There's a ladder. But can't reach it from here. After you. I'm just too smart. What was place? I don't know. I don't know. Some sort of facility. The transmission. Oh, no, Fox. Yeah, Can I not help it? Oh, it's dead. Okay, well, no, I can't help that. Oh, hello. Get to the That's new. Never seen one of those before. Me neither. Me neither. It's like a mole rat. Those dead machines have it on alert. How do you want to handle it? Focus can help us. We can scan the machine before we make our move. Okay. Um. Okay. See how parts of it are glowing? Those are its weak spots. Got it. Very cool. It's out. God. There we go. Sorted. Another one's coming. Oh, is it? Find anything good? A few supplies. Whoa. There we go. Awesome. So after the fuss over me leaving, what did everyone else do? Well, as soon as the celebration was over, my mother got the rest of the Nora home. Sun King put his people to work rebuilding the city. Oh yeah. And I said I could find you. Fair enough. You said you had a focus since you were a child, right? Yep. Yeah. I found my first one when I fell into a ruin. Got the others from an old cache not long ago. Um, fair enough. Welcome to the Far Zenith launch facility. Oh. Far Zenith? I, I know they made some tech trades with Zero Dawn, but. Why would they have a backup of Gaia? Please register with reception for the tour. I guess they want us to check in with them. Sure. Please hold for identity scan. Access denied. Looks like Mark Zuckerberg. Please wait here for personnel to assist you, Doctor Sobek. Okay. I guess they weren't on great terms with Elizabeth. Great. Well, let's find a way in. How about this big glowing door? Nice. Can we take anything? Whoever left us here might have also shot those machines we found earlier. So where are they now? Good question. What's that stench? This, apparently. Damn. I doubt. Good lord. They must have come here to Del for scrap. Acid. That explains the smell. And it looks like something big came in from above. Crashed right through the camp. And then through the wall. Just we'll lodged with the pulling force. In that gap. Whatever came through here brought this down as it went out. If I can dislodge some of the debris, we might be able to squeeze through. Maybe I can find something to help in the camp. Hey, okay. Over here. I think oh. I got something. It's some kind of Osram prototype, I think. This hook looks like it can latch onto things. And this gear pulls it back. Hmm. It looks broken, but maybe we can repair it. Hook it to the debris. And pull it out. 
That could work. Cool. The focus can help us search the camp and identify anything we can use to fix the tool. My focus picked up a couple of things to check out. Oh, what's that? Guy. Training dummy. Anything useful? Part of a machine. Nice. Could help fix the gears. Metal shards, chill water. Can I hit this? Sick. Destroy it fully. Yeah. Yeah, I really did show that guy. Pull caster. Dope. Oh, okay. Cool. So anything that has a grated pattern. Alright. Ah. Oh, cool. Awesome. Sick. What's this? Who knows? I can't touch it. Doesn't let me. What's this thing for? Well, that's what I'm trying to figure out. God damn. Wow. That worked. That's awesome. Hell yeah, dude. This is sick. Hold on. Pull that down. Ancient toothpick, lovely. And an iron ingot. Great. This is pretty. Humans, Homo sapiens, us. We have always pushed the boundary as explorers, pioneers, trailblazers. And now Far Zenith is taking the next leap into the future. That's why we're proud to have resurrected the Odyssey. When our government's abandoned in orbit, Far Zenith will actualize in less than a decade. But that's only the beginning. When the ship is complete, we will send the Odyssey and her crew where no one's gone before. Humanity's first off world colony. The Odyssey may take 300 years to reach it, but when we look up at the night sky, we'll know they're on their way. And in the words of our founder, the late Peter Chimbumbe, the truest form of immortality is data corrupt. <laughs> the playback stopped. No, oh, great. The old ones could fly through the sky? Between the stars? Yeah, dude, rocket ships. Uh, well, yes, sort of. That ship, the Odyssey, it, it never made it to the other star. Something went wrong, and it blew up. Elizabeth gave them a backup of Gaia for a colony? Probably. Error. Public presentation file corrupted. Member recruitment file available. Do you wish to reactivate? Yeah. Reactivate. Let's see what else they had to say. We all know the projections. Economic instability, new biocontagions, rampant AIs. How long before another catastrophe creates unacceptable risk for the world's elite? We here at Far Zenith believe, escape the inevitable. And so we reach for the stars. Now you've seen what we're building here. Infrastructure to support the Odyssey's construction. 
a state-of-the-art data center to facilitate rapid technological advancements. And you've seen how we're managing public perception. So invest and join us. Claim your birth on the Odyssey. Preserve your way of life beyond the concerns of Earth. Well, they were right about the world ending. They just didn't know how... yet. So everything they said back there about the next step for humanity, it was all a lie. These people only cared about saving their own skin. Yeah, well, didn't work out for them in the end. That Oswald guy mentioned a data center. There. The backup. It should be stored in there. Won't be able to swim across. I guess we'll have to find a way around. Come on. Yes, ma'am. Oh, I'll go up there. What's up here? Show off. <laughs> I'm surprised she's strong enough to just rip this wall down, to be honest. I wouldn't be able to do that. Oh, God. What is that? Ugh. Keep your guard up. Freaky. Oh, my guard is. <laughs> Me too. More, more rats. Careful. Don't want those things to call in some friends from underground. You take the left one. I'll deal with the one on the right. Okay. Cool. Go away. Stop scanning. There we go. Nice. Good job, dude. Nice. Where did it go? Oh yeah, right, I can scan. I did not mean to throw that right on top of him. Sorted. Oh god, there's another one. Okay, I'm in through. been meaning to mention I noticed you have a oh. new look these days the beard yeah <laughs> yeah I know Didn't I love have it. a lot of time to shave when I was trying to catch up to you don't worry it's not permanent no make it permanent sorry my whiskers offend you anointed <laughs> the Osram must have used explosives against the machines they managed to get a couple yeah, I mean, good for them. Like there was a barricade here. The machines must have broken through. I'll take all these shards. Thank you very much. Chill out, dude. You're going to get booby trapped. Another training dummy. Let's beat here. it up. <laughs> Come on, just move a little bit further. Oh, there we go. Yeah, sounds like it, doesn't it? Good lord. Nice. Do you mean you didn't need to be that dramatic about it? But nice. So the storms, the blighted lands, the rivers and lakes choked with algae. You were born to fix all that? Yes. It's really cool that it highlights places you can climb now as well. Is there any point going down there? Is that where I just was? Who knows, dude? Oh God! You okay? Can I jump that? Yeah. Don't it's think so. Going that way. Can I? Can't grapple. Oh, I can climb this though. Oh wait. I don't think this is where I just was. That looks like the way we came. Are you sure? You've been in a lot of old world ruins. Oh yeah, it is. Are they all like? Oh, oh really god. Apart. 
Well, it is a thousand years old. Oh, yeah. I mean, that's definitely a factor. Onzu. The Zero Dawn terraforming system. The brainchild of Dr. Elizabeth Sobek. Empowered by nine subordinate functions, Gaia, the core of the system, is capable of advanced planetary engineering. An obvious advantage to our space colonization efforts. Operation Phase 1. Establish an asset within Project Zero Dawn. Status complete. Phase 2. The asset will secretly beamcast a complete copy of Gaia and her subordinate functions to this facility's data center. If all goes well, Zero Dawn staff will remain completely unaware of the transmission. Risks. Discovery of this operation could result in Zero Dawn withholding the already negotiated Apollo database. Special care must be taken not to alert Travis Tate, the expert hacker in charge of Hades Protocol. In addition, extreme caution must be exercised in regards to Dr. Sobek herself. As one of the world's preeminent technologists, she may have instituted unforeseen security measures. A complete assessment is attached. This concludes the executive summary. I thought Elizabeth sent the backup here, but she didn't. Far Zenith stole Gaia. Aloy, why does that woman look like you? Uh, um, it's okay, Pro. We look alike because we're the exact same, genetically identical. But she was one of the old ones. How can you be her? Because I wasn't born. I was made by a machine. It's why I'm motherless, why I was cast out as an infant. I don't understand. What kind of machine can make a person? Remember when I said the backup is like a set of instructions? It's. More than that, it's called Gaia. And for a long time, she cared for the world until she had to destroy herself. So she made me to bring her back. I'm the only one who can. And this place is my last hope. You once said the goddess spoke to you when you went into All Mother Mountain. Was that this? Gaia? Yes, but she's not the goddess, Borl. There isn't one. How can you be sure? It sounds like she anointed you with a sacred task. I've had a lot of time to figure this out. And you will too, with the focus. But for now, the report said they were going to store the stolen copy of Gaia in the data center. So that's where we have to go. Okay? That's a lot of info to just throw on someone, especially someone like Val. Oh, good lord. Oh, god, it's like a big... It's like a titan boa. Ugh. I can do more damage to you while I'm through. I better switch to my boat. Gotcha. Nice. I'll take that wood. Thank you very much. Ah, oh, so that's how that boost thing works. Very cool. Whoa. That's cool. That big metal thing looks like the ship we saw back in the auditorium. Imagine going up to the stars and that. Yeah, imagine. Be awesome. Go on, go to that bush, I dare you. No, he's going past it. I did not mean to do that. That's what I meant to do. Nice. Sorted. Oh my god, look at it go. Good job. Nothing that way. Tell me something. something in here. 
Sona was really okay with you not going back to the sacred lands? As the Nora war chief, she understood why I was obligated to follow you. But as my mother, she wasn't pleased. Is she ever pleased? I don't think I've seen her smile. Me neither. Where the hell do I go? Aha! La Dare. Look at that thing, dude. It's so... Oh, there's three of them. They literally are just big snakes. Three of those things. And if they slaughtered all those Osram, we'll never get through to the data center. There's no way to slip past them. They're too tough to fight head on. We could find a settlement. Convince some hunters to help us. That would take weeks, and we don't have that kind of time. Maybe all we need is that shuttle to fall. Ah, crush them all. That thing? How? I'll figure it out. Just wait here. Aloy. <laughs> Trust me. And there she goes. There she goes indeed. <laughs> Aloying. What is that? Just another mole rat. Ah, it's a supply box. Okay, so there's only two in this section. If I can make it to that tower, we should be able to find a way across to the shuttle. No, I didn't mean to do that. Just throw a rock right there. And there you go. Nice. Got a trophy for it and everything. Sick. I can reach it if I launch myself off that grapple point. Take that stuff. Why am I up here? Please do not break. Oh, there's a box. Ah, oh, screw it. I don't care. This is so cool. This new grapple thing is sick. Made it. That way. Oh god. Uh, Jesus Christ. Uh, I was close. One rickety tower down. On to the next. Jump. Nice. I'm like Kyle Crane. Oh good lord. That was lucky. Oh, I thought I'd be able to climb that rope. That would have been awesome. This place is barely holding together. Yeah, honestly. I mean, as long as rocks like don't fall and crush me, I'll be fine. I bet there's a control console nearby. I bet there's robots nearby too. Don't see me, don't see me, don't see me, don't see me. Nice. There we go. Oh, come on. There you go. Okay. Let's get these clamps off. Oh, okay. wait. Oh, okay. Crush those machines down below. I thought I was gonna have to like find them and destroy them, not just do that. God damn. Come on. Oh, they have like grindy gears on them. That's cool. God damn it. Do I have to climb all the way up there? It's pretty high. Oh my god. Okay, fine. Just pull that down for some reason. Don't know what it does. 
it does exactly that. All right. Jump up. Wow, okay. I didn't think I'd be able to reach that. So far, so good. Nothing's broken on me. Up here. That way. Cool. This way. Nice. Up here. Shoot it. Awesome. Oh, okay, I have to climb even higher. Uh, here we go. Aha. Yeah, maybe he was. However, like you said, we couldn't fight him. And we wouldn't be able to go through him. So. Okay, I thought there might be crates, but no. Oh, wait, there is. Right here. Cool. Almost there. There's the other connector. Goodbye, rocket ship. You would awesome. Oh my god. I didn't think it'd explode. Didn't think there'd be fuel still in it. Oh, good god. Awesome. Oh no, is it still alive? Okay, yep. Do we have to? Do we really have to? Uh, canister, canister, fangs. Okay, you're moving too much. There we go. Oh my god. Gross. Ow. Hey. Can I like... Yeah, there we go. Oh crap. Come on. Shit. Oh my god. Look at it go. Holy crap. Well, it's free. Come on, it's so close. One more. Just, just hit it. Just hit it in the canister. There we go. Oh my god, that was an intense first battle. I was not the data center should be expecting that. Oh my god, I can pick this up. I was gonna have to find another way there. Wait, no, what does this do? What can I do with it? Oh, it shoots. God damn, look at this thing. What an achievement. How do I get out of here? Oh, there we go. Well, that was fun. Fought a big Once snake. Up, Made a rocket fall from the sky. Fix the system. Pretty good day. It's here. Hello. 
Hi. Elizabeth? Travis Tate. Now, what's this we got here? A far as the conspiracy to steal a copy of Gaia? And her subordinate functions? Naughty, naughty. You want me to handle this, Liz? Blasphemers! Brew the vipers! With a mighty hand, I smite and pour troubles upon you! Aloy? The goddess. There is no goddess. I told you that already. That's not Gaia. That's not what I'm looking for. It's nothing but a fake. sharp bite sometimes, you know. But it was pretty amazing to see you fly off that tower and blow up the entire basin. The thing is, um, there's going to be more of that. I'm out of leads, Varl. But I, I have to keep searching. And fast, and whatever risks I have to take, I will. And it doesn't make sense to have someone with me. Someone who might get hurt. This is on me, Farrell. Nobody else. Hold on. Before, in Meridian, you said there was a man who helped you. Silence. You said you used to talk to him a lot about things you discovered from the old world, things no one else understands. And he gave you the lance you used to defeat Hades. He's gone, Farrell. I haven't heard from him since the battle against Hades. Sure. But Spymaster Murad, back in Meridian, he's good at finding people, isn't he? Varl, I... <sighs> Come on, it might work. Plus, you'll get to see some friendly faces again. <sighs> okay. I... I guess it's worth a shot. We've got a long walk ahead. Actually... I've got a better idea. Savior of Meridian has returned. You earned this welcome. You saved them. Not yet. In the name of the Sun King of Vard, a royal welcome for the champion. Make way. Murad, Aloy has an urgent matter to discuss. Dashain, that makes two of us. I've sent forth hunters for weeks. The sun fall all the way to the sacred land, searching for you. Something happened at the spire. Come. I'll 
show you. Watch your step. You saved us all, to be sure, but uh, we're still cleaning up the mess. It happened right after the solstice. We were able to explain it away, thank the sun. Otherwise, it might have caused a panic. <laughs> One night, for less than half a minute, it glowed an angry red. From Meridian, it looked like a trick of the light. But those who were closer, atop the light, said it could not have been a reflection. Much to my dismay, they said the light rose up from the tower's base. From that. We left everything just as it was. What do you think happened? I don't know. The Spire's supposed to send out signals, messages, for the terraforming system. But Hades tried to use it to wake up ancient war machines. I was sure I got the connection to that thing. Wait here while I check it out. Let us know what you find. Okay. I've got a bad feeling about this. So do I. I could pull this thing out of the What? He did. I'm gonna fucking climb the. All right, dude. Uh oh. Maybe I can jump to that ledge behind me. You already have. Very cool. There we go. Nice. Then I can pull no. this off as well. Over to the nice. Should be able to get it. And now I just climb. Silence was helping me when he gave me his lance. But it looks like he tricked me. Oh yeah, that makes sense. Did he save Hades? Because I was wondering how he managed to Why would he do that? get him back over. But yeah, that makes sense. I can track him down. Hopefully the trans. In you go. I see you finally figured it out. To be honest, I'm surprised it took you so long to discover my rules. You raped the lands to steal Hades. How could you be so reckless? Reckless? You're the one who tried to purge Hades before its precious knowledge could be... extracted. 
The mysterious signal that woke it, for example. But why don't tell one of those Gaia backups you've been having such a hard time finding? If you knew, why didn't you just tell me? I've been having problems of my own these past six months, Leloy. The difference is, I've made progress. So once your anger at my entirely necessary deception has faded, now why don't you come out here and find me in the Forbidden West and learn all that I've discovered? Oh, I'll come find you, all right. Yes. Well, the coordinates should make it simple enough. Even for you. What a twat. Hello, peeps. I have good news and bad news. You went inside it, and it transformed. Almost like the day of the battle. I can only be grateful that it's a stormy day. Few will have seen the tower change from Meridian. What did you discover? Hades. The danger didn't end here. It went into the Forbidden West. And I have to follow. I see. That can be difficult. The West is called Forbidden for a reason. A tribe of ferocious warriors controls much of it, the Tanakh, and they allow no trespassers past its border. That said, under the Sun King of Art, a fragile peace has been negotiated, and indeed, the next embassy will take place in a day or two on the edge of the frontier. Were you to attend the gathering under his auspices, the Tanakh might grant right of passage instead of hunting you and attacking on sight. Great, just what I need. More killers. Uh, the Sun King. Aloy, it's good to see you. You left in such haste. We never had a chance to properly thank you. Can, can we show the champion the spear now, please? It's a min. Quiet. It's true. We bear gifts. Decorum usually calls for a ceremony of offering at the palace, but I thought you would prefer a less formal occasion. Bring them, please. A Avad, this is all very kind, but I... Uthit. Vanasha. Quick. Better hand them over before she runs off again. Really? Must you? Shiny. Try it on. It's beautiful. On behalf of all the citizens of the Sundom, may these tokens remind you of our eternal gratitude. Perhaps you'd like to spend more time with your friends. Come speak to me when you're ready to depart. All right. Very fancy. Yeah, I can't believe they made a fucking statue of me. That's insane. Is that a statue of me? Yes, it is. Let's get this spear modified. Who are you? Even if you did leave us hanging after the big battle. Vanasha, stop. She's here now, isn't she? For the moment. I do not remember either of you. It was probably a side quest that I never did. You saved our butts. If you've got to go, go. With our blessing. Always. I literally have no idea who you are. Little Huntress, come back someday and tell us about your adventures. Of course. I can't get Person that I do not know. Craft. Cool. Light melee attack. Yeah, I know how this works. Cool. Okay, before I do this, I'm going to end this episode here. It's been a while, and I don't see it stopping anytime soon. So, as always, if you enjoyed, hit the like button, leave a comment. Let me know if you enjoyed this episode, and if you're excited for the rest of the series. Already, 
this is a much better game than the first one. I got kind of bored when I was getting to the end of the second game, and I'm already having much more fun on this one. So, I'm excited for the rest of the series. Anyway, I will see you all in the next episode. Toodaloo, buckaroos.